Good evening everybody. Welcome to another Ham Fan Presents. Ham Fan. Fun with Quan Sheng. Today we're going to be sending a message, a simple text message, whether it's gobbledygook or whatever, between these two radios. Now, as you can see on this side, we have the Quan Sheng UV5R. Sorry, oh my goodness me, UVK5. And on this side, we have another Quan Sheng, which is the UVK5 brackets 8 brackets. Now, I have seen these online referred to as the UVK6, and lots of other people are calling the UVK6. However, when I look at Quan Sheng's website, it's actually UVK5 brackets 8 brackets. So whatever this UV, UVK6 came from, I have no idea. But this is the UVK5 brackets 8 brackets. Now we're going to send a, a simple text message between both the radios using a modified firmware. Now, the Quanshen KFE, the UVK5, already has the firmware installed on it. So I'm just going to show you that it can also be installed on the the UVK5 brackets 8 brackets because they're both the same firmware and the only thing I can see different is how it looks. Um, all the same settings are still in there, the same output is there. I, unless my software, unless my, sorry, my uh, power output is wrong, but they both give the same output. And uh, there's other people online referencing the UVK6 and showing a picture of this one. but. The UVK6, according to Quan Sheng's website, doesn't exist. Anyway, that's uh, by the by. So, as I said, the UVK5 already has the software and the, the firmware installed. This one doesn't, so I'm just going to show you how to do it on this radio. So, first of all, we just uh, get the software loaded up. And we get the... Which is this? It's called UVK5... No, uh, version number 26, I believe that is. Oh, no, no, sorry, but firmware 2.6. It's based on the, two point, the point 0.26 version, sorry. Uh, so let's get that in, get that ready in here. Okay, it's ready now. We need to put this radio into uh, firmware update mode. So you push and hold the PTT and turn it on, and the light comes on at the top. So let's get, uh, let's get the, my favourite cable plugged in. Okay, now then, now that's in, I'm going to drop this down, and by my usual system is, um, since I haven't changed anything, it's COM5. So, road COM5, we've got the firmware version, the radio's on, it's in firmware writing mode, so we say connect and update. And as you can see, the light is now flashing, which is indicating the firmware is updating. Now the firmware you're seeing on my computer screen here is the exact same firmware as what is currently installed on this one. So let's just wait for this to finish. Okay, it's finished. So let's just click OK. Now we don't really need the computer screen much anymore, but I don't have a very good um, setup for my camera here. So as you can see, that radio has restarted. Um, and we're just going to use the, the, the frequency that's on there, which is 144.55. So let's turn on this radio. Welcome. Frequency mode. Okay, that's just a bit of paper to try and keep the balance. And I've got, there we go, oh, there we go. I need to get a decent camera. Okay, so to go into the text messaging mode, you push and hold the bottom until the light flickers there we go then you leave go and you can see it's put up like a, a blank screen so we do the same on this one so we push the light push and hold the bottom button and as you can see they're both just sitting there so let's go on to this one now the keys obviously not on the here the what letter does what what number does what so you have to work it out. I mean, this one is the like the period, comma, semicolon, all that sort of stuff. So this one is 
let's have a look. So it's A, B, C, capital A, capital B, capital C. A, B, C, okay. And then we jump to this one, which is um, number three. And as you can see, it moves on to D, E, F, then D, E, F. And this one, so you've got, sorry, not the asterisk, you go down to number four. And again, so each each letter, each sorry, each number is three letters of the alphabet. And if you want to skip one or move on, you push the scan button and then so you go on to the next one. So if you've got two letters in this same, let's, let's delete all these out. Put the exit delete and I pushed it too many times, so we'll have to jump back into the there we go, back in again. Right, so let's just say hi. So it will be A B C D E F G H. So it'll be this one. So H and then we push that and we do the I. You say hi, okay, and then to send that, you just push the memory button. And as you can see on the other one, it did a receive on RX, and it says hi in the bottom. So we do the same thing on this one, and let's just say I don't know, by B Y E or B Y or however you want to pronounce it, whatever. To those who, anyway. So let's go to B, and so this will be Y, so um, uh, down here somewhere. Oh, it's not that one. So let's go push the exit button once, and you'll see it will delete that last one. So let's go to the must be on 9. Yeah, bye. And then look for B, C, D, E, so it'll be number three. Hi. Right. And then we send that. And as you can see, it says RX, and it's you see it on by on the other side. I asked for the range on this, I don't really know. Um, it's doing this on 144.550, so I suppose, theoretically speaking, if your line of sight and there's nothing in your way or whatever that's what line of sight means obviously um we're on top of a mountain this should work quite a distance now this is just a hacked firmware as you need to remember so there's no checks there's no confirmations to make sure the data was received properly there's nothing like that as i say it's just a firmware just to play around with it and yeah anyway that seems to work so what I'll do is I'll put a link to the firmware of the uh, clever person that's been developing this. Well, it's be actually been out for a while now. And um, yeah, so that is how you send a simple text message between two quanchangs. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say now. So I do have another another radio coming in, which is another which is an, um, a digital one by one of my favourite companies, um, JYJTY, um, which is my current favourite digital radio I have. Yeah, much better there. I, I do like my Baofeng, but I, I think it's much better. Um, but unfortunately, it's not very well known. And, uh, yeah, so you can't really seem to find it anywhere. I'm going to see if there's anybody on AliExpress that's selling it, because it's actually a really good radio. Anyway, this is about the Quansheng, and... Um, yeah, have fun. Good night, Al, and seven threes all.